Hello, and welcome back to the madness. <coughs> okay, really? I'm going to start choking? <coughs> we are doing a post review on my sons. Now, in the camera, it doesn't look that bad. But, okay, in my defense, these were bought before I started diamond painting. This was a Christmas present for my son because he said he wanted to do diamond painting. As we all know, he put 200 drills on here. He's very proud. He counted them and made sure it was exactly 200. He counted it twice. Whatever. So, he does not like diamond painting, so he asked if I would do it, or I offered to do it. Whatever. He's going to frame it. I don't know how he's going to frame it. After he's done, I will show you, though. So, haha, I came prepared. So, this one is Star Wars. It is uh, 30 by 40. It was $7.99. And I got it off of Amazon. And the seller was the original. The symbols were awful. So hard to read. Um, it was kind of like their printer was running out of ink some places. So it was kind of fun to do but not fun to do um what else was my little notes in here and it took me five hours and eight minutes to finish yes i am starting to time myself so when i start drilling i start the timer and when i have to get up and do something i stop the timer and I wrote it all down, and then I calculated, and it was five, 11 hours and 8 minutes. Which, I think, I really feel if the symbols were better to read, it wouldn't have taken me that long. I felt like I took a long time just trying to figure out what symbol it was. Because we had a lot of these where there's the box, and there's the, I don't, it's not even an arrow. It's like this little part of the square is shaded or this little part so one going this way one going this one one at the bottom one at the other bottom do you understand what i'm saying it was very 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 oh here i can show you oh a diamond just fell off or was it an extra one okay hold on let me look i haven't rolled this yet so i think it was just one that was you know when you're drilling and you drop a drill? I think that's what it was because I don't see any missing drills on this. So we're gonna cough it up to that. Okay, so. Chalk it up to me. What? Chalk it up to me. Chalk, what did I say? Chalk it up. Okay, so right here I can give you two examples. Do you see it? Nope, nope, where are you? Okay, let me get. <coughs> Come a little closer. I won't bite. I just nibble. Okay, we're looking at symbol 30 and 31. Yep, can we focus? Why does it feel like it's not there? Okay, wait, where is it? Okay. Okay, okay. Okay, you see it? I hope you see it because it looks like you can see it. 30 and 31. Those were aggravating. And then up here, it was re reversed. And no, I didn't like it. And there was check marks, and you would think, oh, check marks, those would be easy. No, because the printer was uh, running out. But it really does look okay in the um, camera. And from far away, it does look really good. But my son's like, it's like half of her face is missing. It kind of got lost, and, and I just felt the drill. Um, it kind of got lost in the, well, the, uh, 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 lifesavers, the blast from the lifesavers, but I think it was, it was kind of cool, but, um, for you guys don't know, for, oh, what, I can't speak, my words are not coming out, my son got married last October, and the theme of their wedding was Star Wars, so, if you look on Instagram, I put some pictures on, not a lot, but I did put some up there. There's a great picture of um, 
his best friend, I'll tell a little story because this was short. His best friend um, is in the military and they got, they he proposed, got another, I really have to, um, yeah, but I'm trying to put this drill here. That's why I can't think. Um, he proposed on 4th of July, 2017, Becca? Yeah, because they got married in 2018. So, it just happened that his best friend was here because they always come for 4th of July, which they didn't this year. Um, anyways, um, they always come for 4th of July, so that's why my son, another reason why my son proposed on 4th of July, so his best friend Greg could be here for it. So, um, you know, Jonathan asked him, will you be my best man? And he's like, dude, I'm going to be overseas. He's, he was being sent out of country for a year and a half. And he was supposed to get back like the first week of November, I want to say. And it just worked out where he got back, I think it was five days or a week before my son got married. And they knew this like maybe two weeks before he got married. So, or maybe it was a month. I don't remember now. You know me and dates. I don't remember. So anyways, oh, I just moved you. Sorry, guys. Um, oh, I just kicked you. Um, so we kept it a secret. And you'll see on Instagram, my son is up at the altar. And you'll see that he's walking down. Greg is walking down in his uniform. And Jonathan had no idea that he was going to be there. And my son cried like a little baby. And it made me cry like a little baby. And it was a wonderful moment. And if you want to see the pictures, they're on Instagram. But every time I look at that picture, all I do is start crying because I knew what it meant to him. And it was amazing how we pulled it off because it was very hard to pull off. It was very hard. The night before, we were at my daughter-in-law's um, bachelorette party, which Greg was with us. And he's like... Hey, Jonathan's texting me right now. And it's like, what are you saying to him? Be, act normal, act normal. <laughs> we were all giving him a hard time. So it was funny. And then trying to sneak him into the chapel because we were only allowed to be in the chapel. Uh, I think it was 30 minutes before the wedding actually happened. And trying to sneak him in with Jonathan in there, it was a nightmare. But we pulled it off. If you look at the pictures, you see we pulled it off. And um, the person who became his best friend, uh, his best man, it was, um, his name is TJ. Well, we call him TJ. Um, he likes to be called Timothy. After he turned an adult, he likes to be called Timothy. And I told him, uh, no, you'll always be TJ to me. But anyways, um, TJ did not... Uh, was not mad that Greg was there. And because Greg and TJ and Jonathan were like the three amigos. So, yeah. And we were, we even surprised TJ too. And TJ was like overwhelmed too. So it was, it was a great day. But anyways, Star Wars was the theme of their wedding. And we had quite a few Star Wars things. They walked in the hall to the the, the uh, lightsabers they walked under the lightsabers um the song that they walked into was what is it called becca wedding party you walk into the cantina band you got to speak up because i'm not gonna be able to pronounce that wedding party walked into the cantina music and then jonathan and morgan walked into the Death March? Imperial March. Imperial March. I always call it the Death March. Which, um, the guests got a kick out of that. It was just really a great time. So, that is my, um, post review to this. Um, he has another one too, which is probably gonna be the same way. But, he really wanted this, um, to be hung up in his house. And, so... 
Hopefully that's happening. See, that's another long story. We're just waiting and waiting, which I've, I know I've talked about it. So, but I wanted to get this done for him. So he has one of them done and I'll probably do the other one for him too. So, okay guys, I hope you have a great night. Sorry if this felt rushed. It felt rushed. I don't know why. I feel like I'm just talking a mile in a minute. But you got a little story out of it too. So, I mean, what is there? There's not much you can say about a post review. I gave you all the information that I had. And I'm quite proud of myself that I had that information. So, um, see you in the next one. Bye, guys.